doesn't look there's any much livelihood going on here. I don't know. All these abandoned buildings you can see all the way back. You can see the road there. Oh, how long that's gonna take? But we hope this is gonna be done soon. Go back. You can see all this infrastructure here. Guys, I think you can see all that here. You know, we don't know who is running them and stuff like that. But uh, rocks, the rocks are all flying on the road, stuff like that. You can see all that. You can see this here. Just left unattended. Rotten. See all this. Yeah. see here guys the structure is literally coming down no how long that's gonna take but we hope this is gonna be done soon because this hey good afternoon good afternoon my youtube viewers i'm back here in st louis missouri yeah, I'm on the sides of East St. Louis, where it's one of the murder capital in one in, in the country of the United States. So I hope you guys uh, will join me as I'm traversing around, showing you guys how some of these streets look like and uh, how dilapidated and rundown it gets like. So I hope you guys will join me as we go this together. All right, thank you, let's go. Yeah, like you can see here, the streets, most of the streets are really looking run down. And uh, you can see there was a mansion over here, it's called the Max. I think it was left a while ago. Nobody knows what was going on about here. So. It looks like her. It doesn't have. It doesn't hold a future at the moment. But uh, I'm gonna go around and uh, showcase to you guys how these streets look like and stuff like that. Yeah. So you can look all these streets here. We have some gang bang over here. They come and hide the over inside here. Let me show you something in here. Something in here. I'm gonna show you real quick. You can see how it looks like in here. It doesn't look like this life in here. Stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't look like this life on here in here. These all abandoned buildings. So I'm gonna keep watching, walking. Show you how these things look like. Pibli building this was left long time ago long 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 time ago here I think it was closed it have been closed and all that you can see all this infrastructure here guys I think you can see all that here all this has been abandoned and uh, I understand some people living there the homeless people and stuff like that so it's kind of sketchy you can look at this if you can see from here from afar you can see how these structures look like it's been left and you know we don't know who is running them and stuff like that but uh yeah i just want to show you guys how this place look like you can see there's another building down there the structure it was left a lot you can leave all this <coughs> see all this here these are all abandoned structures like you can see this is the Pivli over here yeah all this was left a while 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 back so we don't know what's what's the deal but uh yeah you can see guys 
there's another one down in front of me you can see here there's another one here yeah these are all abandoned buildings these are all run down hoods of our uh, abandoned streets and structures in uh, East and Lois yeah it doesn't seem like there's any form of life over here so yeah let's let's keep walking and see what we can see so far yeah all these are they are kind of uh, infrastructure that were holding big businesses but unfortunately I think the business went out uh, prior our uh, uh, COVID outbreak yeah stuff like that so you can see you can see the barricades ahead like cars cannot move over here it's only you can walk and stuff like that and see this is a people building rocks the rocks are all flying on the road stuff like that you can see all that you can see this here see this stuff here i'm gonna go in and see how it is like right now i can see some particles still running off and uh you know coming down and stuff like that yeah you can see guys see all this you can see glasses the mattresses and everything it's run over of all this stuff here you can see in a clear angle yeah the journal so whatever it was running at that time you can see guys at a very good angle all this building you're seeing right here it's all been abandoned all this abandoned here yeah so let me get a close look and get in here and see what's going on. Yeah. You can see here. I think there was a cleaner. I love it. Yeah. And see guys. Oof. It's looking so scary here. It looks so scary. see guys here all these infrastructures left unattended rotten and stuff like that you can see guys yeah let me go further there's so many glasses broken glasses down here if you're not careful you gotta have very good shoes and you might really get injured over here stuff like that now you can see guys here yeah you can see like it just looks like someone was just sleeping down here smoking and everything you can see all this yeah yeah this is the hoods of st louis actually i feel i should come to st louis and cover the st louis hoods and streets and uh, maybe away from Kensington, you know, um, uh, Skid Row in uh, Los Angeles, California, and uh, you know, Seattle, Aurora Avenues, and stuff like that. So, yeah, guys, you know, I'm just showing you guys in real content, you know. Yeah, this is a real content here. Yeah, these are places you can't assume people, people are living over here. It's kind of hard to believe and imagine people survive down here. So yeah, I'm gonna just jump down here. And uh, show you guys some of these infrastructures that have been left out, out of businesses. You know, like I can show you. You see all that down here. I'm gonna go there in a minute. I'm gonna show you guys down there. You can see it's... Um, it's all left it was left a while back you can see over here you can see this block like that and uh, so far nothing was done about it so it looks like uh, they're just gonna demolish it if not demolish it i'm not sure what's gonna happen next because these things looks like it's about to fall in any given meet any given circumstance 
Yeah, so like you can see, these are all trying to explore these streets of uh, abandoned buildings in East and Lois, Illinois. This part of Illinois and part of Missouri, if I might put it clearly. So from here, if you see from an uncle, you can see all these buildings, you can see all that, you can see all up there. So yeah. So I'm gonna go this other side so I can show you guys uh, what we got. Yeah. Yeah, like you can see guys all the way. This is all East and Lois. Apart from me, you'll see you'll see the arch. I'm gonna show you shortly. You're gonna see the arch in a little bit. Yeah. So yeah. All these are very, very important buildings in St. Louis. But fortunately, they have been left unattended too. Businesses ran out and uh I guess there's no money to inject into it to put it back into life. Stuff like that. Yeah. So I'm gonna take a look inside one of these buildings here. It kinda looks scary. But I'll try. Just show you how these streets look like, you know. Yeah, it's very dangerous. I hear some of them um, you know, it kinda uh hide some gangbang guys were doing drugs and stuff like that and homeless people so you you never know you know so i'm gonna show you guys here you can see this was a school it was a school is for the kids it's called durag durag Surya, whatever it is i don't know what i don't know what name it sounds more like russian language and stuff like that yeah so right here, you can see there's a rain station. There's a rain station here. So, yeah. So far, you can see this. You can look at this. All this piece of wood. You can see guys. It looks so dangerous here. Let me see here, guys. This truck is literally coming down. Literally coming down. Yeah. You can see a lot of poop. People just shitting everywhere. You can see all this. You can see all this. This is ridiculous. Yeah, it looks like it was a school and stuff like that. Yeah. Okay, let's move on. Yeah, you can hear the trains from outside. They just passing by. Yeah, there's a train station the bike moving down here. the building here running empty nobody's in here and stuff like that so I'm gonna go on the other side so I can showcase to you you can see the arch from this angle in a little bit I'm gonna show to you So you can see guys the arch from here what I was trying to tell you guys you can see the arch down here yeah I'm gonna move 
far down this way so I can show you guys more clearly so guys you see those are the buildings I just left here you can see all the streets of St. Louis here you can see the arch down there uh, that's one of the St. Louis monuments that are St. Louis is known for you know and stuff like that so next to me here it's on a high it's a highway that connects to different parts of the uh different parts of the states within the united states going to nashville tennessee chicago yeah and stuff like that you can see all this here you can see here let me move down here and show you guys so you can see that building down there see it over here it's an abandoned building you see also a fall back all the way there most of this building has been abandoned yeah discount city i don't know what it was running i don't know what it was you know i don't know what they were up to with it i think it was a wholesale thing you can see from a distance here you can see all the way all the way this is downtown st louis and up close from me here you can see all these buildings here yeah you can see all these discount boxes these are the hoods of uh, St. Louis, like you can see here, guys. These are the hoods of St. Louis. I was gonna drive here and show you guys how they look like. see guys this is the building I was talking about here it was left way back I don't think anything existed down here yeah also one of the buildings that was left unattended to for some reason I can't really explain down there you can see Spivli PV it's called a PV building as well yeah next to me here there's a bank that is operating so tend to wonder what's going on here you can see here but it has all been blocked so i think getting in there it's not really easy and stuff like that uh, you can see as it is from a distance yeah that's the pp building the pp building down here connected to this one here you can see from here all these abandoned infrastructures in East and Lois. Yeah, we don't, I don't think there's any hope of trying to revitalize them and uh, bring them back to, you know, life. A lot of businesses fell off, you know, due to recession and uh, I'm guessing COVID. Once the COVID hit, it really, really impacted a lot of things down here. 
think they're working on it and stuff like that like you can see I think they're working on it yeah so see it's all black yeah they're working on it see some guys in there maybe trying to refurbish and trying to make sure it's back to working normal circumstances and stuff like that yeah so we'll, we'll find out in the near future how everything goes down here oh so, yeah so yeah stuff like that you know so you can see all that down here there's a train right now it's about to come so all the cars gonna be held up for a minute then the train will pass and down there we'll see all this building you know you can see right here they are revamping it making sure it's operational and uh like you can see the train is coming and uh making sure all the cars are oncoming cars stop by and stuff like that so yeah we'll see about this yeah but pretty much these are very very rundown city it's a rundown street you can see the train moving slowly and all that you know stuff like that going to downtown and all counties of St. Louis and stuff like that so I think it's about to let all the cars come by and stuff like that yeah so if you see across there you'll see the arch so i'll head there down shortly and show you also the arch from a distance and show you guys from here and stuff like that yeah so yeah these are the streets of st louis of east st louis let me be very specific the streets of east st louis yeah yeah Let me cross down that way. to help them to take care of this place you can see all these these are all buildings that was left you know it looks like this all you can see there's a house project here in North, North St. Louis County this is a house project you can see you can see there's nobody who cares about what's going on here I ran over something I don't know what it is I hope the tires are okay yeah the tires are fine so like you can see all these all these are house projects like you can see them here they're all house projects like you can see from here let me try to go show you from the front part it says no soliciting no littering no trespassing no violence will be prosecuted you can see here all this just trying to make this documentary easy for you guys you can see it has been sealed off by wooden 
doors and stuff like that so there's no any form of life that is taking place down here so you see the grass it's really grown long and stuff like that you know you can see there's nothing going on here this is the the project you know these are the projects of east and louis kind of dangerous place at night i wouldn't advise anybody to be at night past any time of six seven o'clock you don't want to be here because you might just attract things that you don't want in yourself you can see all here you can see all this trash everything littered everything left around here you can see trash mattresses and stuff like that some stuff like that insects and some other form of uh, stuff that we don't want to you can see this this is very unhealthy you can see all this so when we say united states it doesn't look all that some parts look good some parts looks okay i was in california you know miami my miami hawaii and stuff like that you know new york you know like you saw brooklyn also has some parts like bronx yeah it has some broken parts every part of this world has its bad part bad side but st louis has its own record too like you can see look all the trash and everything shoes and stuff like that yeah i don't know if these people are given even time to clean up themselves or something like that but it looks way really bad you can see here all these houses you know they look abandoned and uh nothing really concrete is going on here like you can see there's nothing completely nothing you can see the doors and the windows have completely been sealed off by by the wood wood wooden windows or wooden doors and stuff like that you can see the satellite on top of it yeah so really this part of north county is really beaten up has really been beaten up you know looks are run down and uh let me walk a little bit here maybe show you guys here a little bit you can see here glasses were broken and something like that so nothing is going on here you can see everything be left trash and everything you probably could run even with snakes could run through snakes and stuff like that glasses you can see glasses all here thankfully enough i've got a shoes on you know so you can see all this and see how this place look like it's been fenced it's been fenced but nothing's looking better down here yeah so that's all i have for you guys here as we proceed let's continue with the journey as i've captured a little bit of footage over here to show you how this north county looks like yeah they tell you it's one of the dangerous cities there's a reason for everything what they tell you that uh, so you can see how this place looks like really it's crazy 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 more like ukraine something like that you know so beaten down you know 